Guys, recent files feature on Mac can be very useful if you want to get to files or folders very quickly. So how do you use that? So the first method is going to be uh, to go to the Apple logo, click on the Apple logo. So here in this option, you have an option called recent items. So in recent items, all the applications that you may have used uh, recently will come up on the top. If you have any documents that you've been recently uh, going to or you frequently go to will also come up here. If you want to clear the menu, you can just click on clear menu and it will go away. So that is one way. The other way is uh, say I am using pages, right? And if I go to file right now and I go to open, when I click open a finder window pops up and here you have documents. So in this option, you have uh, multiple folders, you have multiple users. You can also access the entire hard drive as well. So that is an option that is available and you can use uh, recent files over there as well. The other and the easiest way to use recent file is say you have applications on your doc. So say I want to do something with notes or I want to use something with pages. So if I click and hold down on pages, you don't have to let it go. If you let it go, it will just disappear like it has right now. So just click and hold with single finger. So once you've clicked and held it down, you have an option for new document. You have an option to keep in doc or open and log in, whatever your preferences. You can have it show all windows. If there are multiple windows that are open, you can hide it or you can quit it. But if you have uh, used pages quite a lot and you have uh, recent files, it will also show you recent files as well. So guys, that is how you use recent files on Mac. If you've liked the video, drop a like, share and subscribe. See you in the next one.